So I went to Lowe's, which is almost like Home Depot, and I spent like two hours uh, trying to uh, figure it out. There's a, there's a video, I will put a link in the description, that tells you how to do it. He doesn't explain it really well, so I have to figure it out. But uh, when I did, it's, it's pretty simple. And I'm gonna show you the, all the materials that I have, that I used. So this was, this was the challenging part. I didn't know how to, how to do this part. But once I figured it out, I think uh, it's not so difficult. The last uh, knot I'm gonna put there, it's, uh, I don't remember the name, but it's not, it doesn't let it move, it doesn't move. Once you tighten it, it doesn't move. So that's why you see me I, tightening it there, like really hard. And then you just uh, put it inside. I'm gonna put some glue on it so it doesn't move. And then you just, uh, just put it on the coupler that we bought, that we used. And then just uh, turn it around, turn it around, turn it around until it goes all the way in. And this hanger, of course, it's not working well because you have to tighten it, the, the opening, but I think it's gonna work all right. And then on this receipt, you can see how much I spent, uh, minus 218 and minus 288, that's uh, $42. Okay, I'm gonna show you how I built my, my painting rack with less than $45. So I bought um, pieces of QVC, this one is one inch, and I bought the 10, 10 feet uh, piece. So I bought two of those, and then I bought a five feet piece. So, and then I cut it, cut them. I cut them at six, six, six inches, six, six feet, six inches. Uh, the ones that were 10 feet. And then with the rest of the tube, I did this little legs. I'm gonna put cement on them so they're heavy and they don't go anywhere and then uh, this one is the the five feet piece I cut it in half and then I use this uh, connector and then I use this one for the for the swivel this is gonna hold the the, the hangers and the doors it's really easy to build. It has little elbows. I'm gonna I'm gonna use glue on this on these parts, and I'm gonna leave these parts open so I can take them apart because that that way it's not gonna be heavy at all. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna put it here like this, and then the other one I'll do the same. This is the way it looks. As you can see, it's really looks really good for less than forty-five dollars. That's a real bargain. Let me know if you have any questions, and I will answer them for you. Thank you.